Welcome back, viewers. Today, we are going to take a fascinating journey into the male reproductive system. Understanding this intricate structure is crucial for anyone curious about human anatomy. So, let's dive right in. First, let's explore the male reproductive system, which consists of several vital parts. The foundation of the male reproductive system lies in the testicles, or testes. These oval-shaped organs are responsible for producing sperm and testosterone, the male sex hormone. Next, we have the epididymis, a coil tube located on the back of each testicle. It serves as a storage and maturation site for sperm before they are transported. The vas deferens is a long, muscular tube that carries mature sperm from the epididymis to the ejaculatory duct. Here, we encounter the seminal vesicles, responsible for producing a significant portion of the semen. They contribute fructose and other substances that nourish and support sperm. The prostate gland is a walnut-sized organ located beneath the bladder. It adds a milky, alkaline fluid to the semen, enhancing sperm motility and survival. Two small glands called Cooper's glands secrete a clear lubricating fluid known as pre-ejaculate. This fluid helps neutralize the acidity in the urethra and acts as a lubricant during sexual activity. The urethra is a duct that serves two purposes, it carries urine from the bladder and also transports semen during ejaculation. However, both functions don't occur simultaneously. And there you have it, the male reproductive system demystified. From the testicles to the urethra, each part plays a crucial role in the process of human reproduction. It's a remarkable system that showcases the wonders of the human body. If you found this video informative, give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more exciting content on anatomy and science. As always, stay curious and keep learning. See you in the next video.